do you ever run out of things to say? In one of our weekly Twitter polls on Twitter, we asked people, when in a group of people, I have trouble thinking of the right things to talk about, true or false? 68% of you said true, 32% of you said false. And so I thought I would do a little video on how you never run out of interesting things to say. So the very first way that you make sure you never run out of things is to read interesting things. So um, I have some absolute favorites that I read every week or at least once a month that always give me interesting, juicy tidbits to talk about. All right. Thank you. So here are some of my favorites. So um, love Entrepreneur Magazine. I'm obviously an entrepreneur, but they have really cool stories about startups and people doing their own thing and having all kinds of business adventures. So that's one of my favorites. Um, I also love for news. I read The Week every week. So The Week is a, a really cool um, magazine that just has sort of a summary of news topics. I always kind of know what's going on in the world without um, having to spend hours and hours listening to radio in the morning. So it's a really cool way to catch up. And the last one, if you're a, a science geek or a history geek like me, is Smithsonian Magazine. So these are the three that I read every week or once a month to make sure that I'm reading interesting things. Second thing I do is read interesting books. So I actually have a post for you, which is my favorite books for interesting conversation. So you can check out this post on our blog. If you go to scienceofpeople.com slash favorite books, you can see all of mine, but I also have some to show you. Thank you. So some of my favorite books that I would love for you to check out. One is Smart Cuts by Shane Snow. So this is an awesome book about um, hacking business advice. Uh, he has some really cool science and here's some really great stories. It's a really fast read. I love it. I was gonna throw it. That would have been scary. Um, I love this book. I even have little tabbies in it of all my favorite things. It's called 59 Seconds by Richard Wiseman. It's all about psychology and crazy things you want to know about human behavior. So that's a really good one. Um, oh, how did this get in there? It's my book, Captivate. Have you checked it out? Some really cool, interesting stuff in there. And then of course, one of my favorite classic books, How to Win Friends and Influence People by Dale Carnegie. So I love this book. Everyone should read it. If you've ever interacted with another human, you should read it. It's one of the books that got me started in my career. So make sure you read interesting books and comment below the video to tell me your favorites. Third, ask interesting questions. So instead of asking what do you do, where are you from, we have an amazing free guide called The Little Guide to Amazing Conversation. You can check it out. When you ask interesting questions, you never run out of things to say. So make sure to watch all of our favorite videos on being interesting right now.